Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Happy New Year, it's 2020 and I wanted to make a new video. Hope everybody had a safe, great New Year's Eve and was able to celebrate with loved ones. Um, and again, we're safe at the end of the night. I can't believe it's 2020. Um, this past decade has been incredible for me going from high school to ending being a working professional adult, um, living in one state and now living in another in the Boston area. But it's been an incredible journey and I'm so grateful and I can't wait to see what 2020 has in store. So for this video, I wanted to talk about some of my favorite things currently and things that I'm a little bit, uh, you know, I really, really, really like in terms of the things that I have. Um, I'm very honest about my materialism. I'm a materialistic person. I do like things, um, but I do go through a checklist of things, right? Do I really want it? Do I really need it? Am I going to use it? If it really checks some of those things off, um, then I really just go for it. I just wanted to go through a few of my favorite things currently. Uh, for the past few months and going to the winter months, I foresee that these are going to be some of my things that I really, really, really enjoy. Um, so for starters, I'm going to start with this bag here. This is a bag. I don't know what the material is called. I forget. Um, but it's a great bag and I'm trying to be more con conscious of not using as much um, paper or plastic. Um, when I go to the supermarket or when I just go buy things, actually in um, the Boston area, plastic is something you have to buy, you have to pay a fee for. So when I just bring a bag like this that you can um, reuse, um, it's made of um, nice material. And these bags, these types of bags are becoming like a big trend. So I saw like um, the canvas bags. Um, I saw that St. Laurent has a bag like this. I also saw that um, Valentino has a canvas bag as well, but this is just got at the Portobello market in London on my last London trip. And it was, I think it was 10 pounds or eight pounds when I bought it. And I thought it was a great deal. It was a great shape. And it fits a great amount of stuff in here. If I go buying stuff at a store, if I go to the supermarket, I get my little essentials in that bag. And I really, really enjoy it. One of the next favorite things that I have is a little beanie. So. I really became obsessed um, with uh, Fisherman's Binnies last year and I got one with a little pom-pom on it and I really, really enjoyed that one. I still use it to this day, but I added one to the series of hats I have for the winter here as well. And that's just a black Fisherman's um, Beanie. It's um, great. It fits my head perfectly. I got it from ASOS.com. I believe I got it on sale, so it wasn't that expensive. And yeah, I really, really, really like this. I mean, I've already taken a ton of pictures in this and I foresee that I'm gonna be using it through the whole entire winter. Um, but I really, really, really like this item. The next thing that I have is actually a gift to my mom. So last year, I took my mom to her first Europe trip over to Spain and Madrid. Um, and it was fantastic. It was a great trip with my mom. I was able to like connect with her as an adult and just like talk about life in a different way instead of just like, child parent dynamic um but she really wanted to get glasses and there was like a two for one sale at this store um and the store was selling two for ones for all well like not two for ones but like there was a deal for you buy two basically it's the price of one of the ones that you buy and she, i ended up picking these glasses from carolina lemke um it's still a co collaboration she has with kim kardashian um they didn't really look for that but it's just like the glasses that i really liked i've wanted glasses like this for years but i really didn't find something to fit me the right way or the way that i wanted to fit um and these are the glasses right here i don't know i really really like these i'll try them on on camera i don't know if they're gonna look good on camera or not but i really really like these um, they come in different shades. I went with this shade because it complements more my skin tone, I think. Um, at least that's what my mom said. But I really, really like these. They also come in really nice packaging. This is the little cover thing for the glasses. And the box is also very beautiful. It's very reusable for gifting and things like that. The next favorite thing that I have, I just bought recently, and is this windbreaker and this 
beautiful color here this combination of blues and a beige here in the middle i really really like this i bought it in a large i bought it at a local shop here in Provincetown, massachusetts um it's like the surf i forget the name of the store but it's like the surfing skateboarding store it's right across from town hall you know province town but this jacket is pretty cool because it's made out of recycled material it's from billabong is the brand um, but I really like the shape. I like um, the pocket in the front as well and the color. The color combination is pretty bomb. So yeah, I really like this a lot. Um, and the last, well, one, one of my last things that I have, it's one of my favorite things, and kind of like a winter essential for me, is this vest. So this vest, I've wanted a vest like this I remember being in like high school and wanting a vest like this and not really having the money to have a vest like this. So I didn't think I had the money to buy a vest like this. But, and even through college, I didn't have a vest like this until um, maybe the very end of college. I think I got one from Zara. But this one is like the perfect colors that I wanted um, since I was young. I love a blue. Blue is my favorite color. This is a blue. <laughs> I'm wearing blue right now. The thing before I show you the windbreaker has some blue in it. And I also was probably um, yeah, I'm gonna be wearing a lot of blue on, on this channel because a lot of my wardrobe comprises of blues, grays, and blacks. Um, but I really, really like this vest. I feel like these vests are a winter essential. I really like um, the design on it. And yeah, I really, really like this. I use this all the time. Whenever I just wanna feel a little warmth, if I'm wearing a flannel, if I'm wearing a sweater, if I'm wearing a long sleeve tee, I add this vest on. And I don't know, I really, really, really like that vest. Um, the next thing I have is a pair of shoes, which is one second. So this is a boot that I got from DSW. It's from 791. It's the brand, but it's a great shoe. I mean, the fit from the front, the look from the front is fantastic. Um, it's pretty affordable to shoe. I think I bought it for like $59, but DSW always has sales but i really wanted something for the winter um fall and this was like the shoe that carried me through the fall and now into the winter um obviously it doesn't have a lot of grip so you have to be careful when you're walking but i really really like that shoe it just looks really great you throw on some jeans you throw on whatever and you're gonna look good you're gonna look a little put together um but i just ordered some boots so hopefully i'll show you guys soon um they're from polo and I saw someone on Instagram wearing those boots and I really, really, really wanted to know where they were from. And so they ended up putting a link and there was the link actually was a sale. So I ended up buying the boots for like under $80 or under maybe $70 too. So I can't wait to show you guys those boots because I already know they're gonna be a favorite. If they don't work out, then I'll return them, but I hope they do work out. But really that's all I have for you guys in this video. Just wanted to share a couple of my favorite things so far this year. Uh, well, within the, this past few months, really, this year only has been a day. But I hope you guys are having a great New Year's and to new beginnings, you know, work hard, be nice to people and just focus on yourself and build yourself up and build others around you because that's what's really going to make you happy ultimately at the end is that you have a positive a group of people around you and that you're positive on yourself. And yeah, that's really all I have. Um, have a great day, everyone. Goodbye.